guys it is swizz and i am back again and today it is game day so we are gonna be facing off versing the san diego chargers i'm not sure if i simulate this or not um but we will see so we're gonna set our inactive players and yes so we're still we still only have two tight ends and uh it's not that great we really have bad tight ends and i'm sorry tight ends but you're bad you're horrible you guys suck i mean one of them can't freaking hold the ball for god's sakes but whatever it's fine it's fine it's fine mate hello hello guys i'm doing a commentary on nfl head coach 09 so yes let's do this thing um it's a commentary yes I know. So we lose this game, and the box score. Uh, we had a pretty good passing game. Uh, it was forty-one to twenty-three. Always managed to blow us out. They really always do. Everybody does actually, because our team isn't that great or good. But who said this is gonna be a stroll in the park? Nobody did. So we are going to go and scout medium school tight ends. And these are the scouting results. So let's view these. Um, well, there's a lot of good wide receivers in this class. But there aren't that many great tight ends. And there's a lot of good comparisons right here. So we got to look out for that. So we are going to be just going through, um, dismissing all these, looking at the weekly awards. Tom Brady wins his second uh, thing in a row. And we are going to be looking at the season stats. Uh, only two interceptions. That's pretty good. Well, we're going to go um, see this. And I'm pretty sure Paint Manning had a bye week. That's not him. Because, look, he's averaging, like, 229 yards a game. So that's not him. Okay, he, he, yeah. Peyton Manning's the best quarterback. He's my favorite player. Because I'm a big Colts fan. Even though he's not on the Colts anymore, he's still my favorite player. And he'll always be my favorite player. And we have a lot of, uh like, not that great, man. Our defense is doing pretty good, though. And the kick returns, look at that. We we shouldn't be having that many kick returns. I mean, I want to limit the kick returns because that means they either scored a field goal or a touchdown, which is bad for us. So we're going to go to team needs. We really need a tight end uh, first string and a defensive tackle first string. And we need a lot of stuff, so... We're going to go to our salary cap status. We have money to spend, but look at those potential incentives. Um, I really don't like incentives. But if it's like start 16 games, I'll hold them off like the last game of the season. I don't care. If it saves us money, then hey, it's all right. And look, I, I see Mercedes Lewis. Um... I don't know. He he's pretty good. He's he's okay. He's he's pretty good. So we're gonna actually trade. Um, we're gonna try and trade away. But I actually meant to hit trade four. I'm pretty sure. Or no, no. I'm checking out the roster. Checking out Mercedes Lewis's, uh, card play page. Whatever you want to call it. And I was trying to see what his potential is, but it doesn't show me. But he's a big uh. He's a big uh, uh, tight end, so that's gr good. So that means he could probably bro block. So we're going to actually trade for him right now. So let's just go to all and then tight ends. So Mercedes Lewis. So we actually have to release a player to get him because we do not have any more uh, roster spots. So we're going to go ahead and release a player. Um, I'm pretty sure... I we release Chris Wet Redman, I'm pretty sure, or somebody with like without any penalty. Um, 
because I do not want to release so many. Oh yeah, no, no, no. We release somebody from here because we have a ton. So he has no penalty. So we're gonna release Fred Thomas. So we could get Mercedes Lewis. So let's go to trade four. And let's go to Lewis. Whatever he has. Alright, there he is. So we're going to trade for him. And they're asking for a lot right here. Um, fifth round pick. I mean, he isn't that good. But if his potential is good, then we're going to match the offer. So they want two fifth round picks, and that offer is ridiculous. I mean, we're the only people trading for him, so it should be at least somewhat uh, respectful. So we're just going to accept this offer right here. So now we have Mercedes Lewis. We're going to check his potential. Hopefully it's okay or good. Uh, so let's go check it. And it is an 80, so that's okay. He still has some room to improve, that's good. And he's young, so we're going to put him at starting. Starting uh, tight end, even though the guy above him is a 70. Who cares? So we have Mercedes Lewis now. I thought I saw like a number 6 or something, but he, it was actually a number 80, so we're all good. We're all good on that stuff. And we're already getting into contract talks. I mean, it, we're almost, we're not, we're like, I don't know, like a third into a, into the year. No, no, like, I don't know. But we're, we're going to see, uh, this guy's pretty old, so I'm going to check who his backup is. And if his backup has good potential, then I am not going to re-sign him. So his backup does not have that good of potential. It's only a 75, so he's going to remain the same all year and all the rest of his career. So we are going to go ahead and re-sign him. Uh, so let's go. Let's do this. That's my finger. And we're going to go to where there's no incentive or anything. So right there. And he goes ahead and accepts it so that's good so we have one guy under our belt for uh like three years i think and tom givens i don't think he'll ask for a lot so we're gonna go into contract talks with him because he is our best linebacker and he has great potential so and i i just clicked a i didn't mean to i just tried to get through that stuff and pure garçon or Gar garçon Garcon, whatever, same thing, pretty much. Um, he was really, he's really, he was really good in uh, Indiana. So he doesn't ask for much. So we're gonna just accept what he wants, and all is good, all is well. So that's awesome. So we have a lot of probables and questionables, and Jason Taylor is a questionable. That is not good at all. He's our best player. Um, so we have an approval change from that, but whatever, who cares? And we are not going to improve kick returns because those are like the last things we want to improve. And, and it's pretty much worthless. So we're going to work with our offensive line, and we have more. Uh, we're not going to do his. Uh, we're not going to accept his or whatever because uh, we don't want to. And he has no potential. We're not going to do his either. I'm really trying to save money for the draft. We're not doing his. Who, who's that? Oh, uh, I don't think we do his. No, we do not. So we're going to go into game plan. Um, we're going to master an offensive play. We have a power toss, so we're going to do that. And... Andre Goodman, we're not going to do his. Uh, let's see, who else? Vernon Carey, uh, we're not going to do his. Travis Daniels, we're not going to do his. Carlos Emmons or whatever. Yeah, I think, I'm pretty sure we're not going to do his. He's old, he old. 
We're not going to play the game either. We're just going to simulate it. Because I really want to improve our team first before I play. Because, you know, it's I got to improve. We, we have to improve. So we're going to set our inactive players right here. And uh, we only get six instead of seven because we have, like, a bunch of people injured and whatever. So we're going to put um carry as a thing as a inactive player we're gonna put that dude uh we're not gonna put that guy because uh you know we can't i mean we could but you know we wouldn't have enough players and i decided to choose lowry and have him be active because he's been all inactive this season and we're just gonna make these two inactive so we have our six players and we're going to simulate this game. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully <coughs> we um, win. And we do not win. So my approval goes down even more. Um, I might, you know, my team. And we have a horrible passing game this game and a running game. Oh, my goodness. 2.4 like passer rating. That's like, ugh. That's like Ryan Leaf, man. This pretty much resembles him. So we're going to go to college scouting. And I'm just trying to think of what we have for team needs. And I remember defensive tackles. So we're going to scout the big school defensive tackles. I'm not sure what I need more. A tight end or a defensive tackle. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to want a tight end more. It's all based on what what I want more. But well, it's not, it's, you know, never mind, I, I didn't mean it like that, but, you know, I was gonna sign that guy at, at top, but he's only 5'11", so we're gonna, uh, sign this Turdell Sands, I think his name is, I didn't get his last name all the way, but we have to release somebody first, so we're just gonna go ahead and, and release, Manual, this dude, Marquand, Marquand, Manual, so, it's fine, it's alright, you know. So we're gonna, what are we doing? I don't know why I always just doze off sometimes during it when I play. Who knows, I don't know, I don't know. Hello, hello guys, hello, hello guys, how are you today? Hello. So yeah, um, I really hope you guys are enjoying this series. Um, I like it a lot. I hope you guys do. It's very fun to make. So we're gonna, yeah, Turdell Sands. We're gonna sign this big guy. He's six seven, over three hundred pounds. So he's gonna hopefully be a force on the offensive line. I mean defensive line. Excuse me. So he's he's gonna be second string. So yeah, and I might sign another defensive tackle. I'm not sure. Um, I might re I might sign that one guy, that one small guy, but then again, I mean he has the best power moves, but he's just so he's short, he's undersized. But that Sands guy, he's huge. He's probably one of the biggest guys on our football team. So we're gonna release this guy, but he has a trait uh, uh bonus. So we're gonna release Roderick, uh right. Probably not the best move, but, you know, we, we he's injured, and we got to improve our team. So we are going to go ahead and sign this Dan Glecko, I'm pretty sure. I was, no, no, we, we signed this guy, I'm pretty sure. I'm just looking at his uh, stuff, because he's a rookie, and he doesn't ask for much. 290000 a year. It's not much for an NFL player. He's probably one of the least paid in the NFL so we're going to check his potential, and it's a 78, so that will do. And we're going to put him fourth string, and we're going to actually look, well, that one guy, what's his name, Tony Bake, he's not even starting. So, I don't know, I'm going to go back there, uh, and actually look at right linebacker, seeing if Jason Taylor can play that position. So we're going to put Tony Bake at starting right end. 
Jason Taylor at the second, and we're going to put Jason Taylor as a right linebacker. So that fills up one of our position needs, so that is good. So I'm just trying to retool these guys a bit, retool our defense just a tiny bit. Just reviewing, seeing if there's anything bad. And, yeah, that's the video. Comment, like, and subscribe, guys. See ya. And this is here because I do some ghetto stuff when I'm recording. Alright, see ya.